Hello, Disney friends and fellow travelers. So today's video takes us in a little bit of a different direction. So we are going to go up north of Orlando to a town called Apopka. Yes, that's right, Apopka. Florida has the funniest names for their towns. You've got Apopka, Okoe, then you've got all the winters, Winter Garden, Winter Springs, Winter Park, and then my personal favorite, Yeehaw Junction. Makes me feel like I need my cowboy hat on. But today, we're going to Apopka. There is an orchid festival happening up there at Kroll Smith Greenhouse. And if you know my husband or anything about him, you know that he loves orchids. He loves plants. He loves gardening. So yeah, we're going to see what they've got. I'm sure they're going to have some interesting species and specimens from all over the world, it said. So very excited. So yeah, come walk with us. So many pretty orchids. Everywhere you look, there's orchids. So lots of different kinds of orchids around here. Not just your usual, usual ones. Lots of different colors. Some bright oranges, purples, yellows. Just about every color of the rainbow. We've got these ones with little teeny, teeny flowers on them. These ones are so cool. They look like a tattoo I have on my back. So pretty and so unique looking. This unique one looks almost like tentacles, kind of like an octopus. Then you can come in through the greenhouse area and see some of them that they're working on and getting ready to have for sale. Lots of different sizes and colors. It's very neat to see. We've got ones hanging up that are bare root ones. So big, the blooms are just huge and so vibrant. I love that purple one back there. And as you walk out, you've got more booths outside of the greenhouse area that have more flowers as well as supplies. Gosh, you can just get about everything here. That's a beautiful, beautiful spring dye. So I think Dustin has made one of his picks. This one is quite wild looking. The ones with the blooms aren't for sale. They are just an example of what it's going to look like after it blooms. So you get the, the smaller plant and you get to work with it and yeah, get it to look all cool like that, hopefully. So they have booths and booths and booths of just orchids everywhere. All different shapes, sizes. Dustin is in heaven. He told me to pick one out. I said, no, I don't take care of them. That's his job, so he needs to pick them out. But yeah, I think he found, found one more over there. Then you walk a little ways over and there's even more vendors down here. You're definitely not at a shortage of, of flowers here. And not just orchids, there's some cactuses there. Look at how cool those are. We got a little wasp back there enjoying these orange flowers. He can stay away from me, but he can enjoy them. They are beautiful. The camera cannot do these justice of just how pretty these flowers are. 
These ones are out in the greenhouse. They are not for sale. You can inquire about them and see if they're willing to sell them, but yeah, they're, they're mainly just to enjoy right now. I'm sure that they probably sell them to hotels and things like that, because these are just beautiful. They almost look fake, they're so pretty. No joke, the size of the blooms are as big as my head back there. They are huge. The color on these yellow ones is so, so bright. So pretty. So many beautiful blooms. These ones have definitely been growing for a while. Ooh, that is awesome. Look at the tiny details on there. Okay, so we made it back from Apopka. Dustin got some orchids and we took those home, checked on the dogs, but now we're hungry. So we're back in Claremont and decided we're gonna hit up one of our favorite restaurants here. It's a relatively new one called Muse Bistro and Bar. It's just a few minutes from our house and it's always been really good. So I'm excited, I'm starving. So let's go get some food. I'm gonna go ahead and get us a seat and some food. Yes. You can take a look at the menu here. So it's got some different appetizers. We always like the crisp ginger and soy green beans. They're so good here. Some salads and we got some, some burgers. Yeah, everything's been wonderful that we've had here. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna get yet. I'm gonna have to look it all over. So we got our green beans. We just have to order them. They are so good. And the sauce that comes with them is just perfect. Dustin got a Stella on tap. I got a glass of wine. Yeah, but they smell so good. I'm ready to dig in. So we got our burgers and we got the exact same thing because it looks good. It is a black and blue burger with blue cheese, bacon, a burger obviously, <laughs> and french fries. It smells so good and I'm definitely not going to be able to eat it all right now. So I guess snack for later too. Woohoo. So Dustin clean plated his burger. He was hungry. I've got some for later and I know I'm going to eat it later because it's so good. But one of the things that we love about Muse is that every Monday they have a community day where it is pay what you can for food. So anybody can come in and get a meal, no matter what they can pay. It's an awesome service. They also, in the afternoon on Mondays, go and do delivery for people that can't get out. It's just such a nice service for the community. And one of the reasons that I love supporting this awesome restaurant, not to mention the food's great. I know my birthday is a long ways away, but I want that shark balloon. So come November, I'm expecting that shark balloon. Well, we just got done with our amazing meal. And now on to my least favorite thing ever, shopping. We're at the Publix. It's expensive. We do Kroger delivery. It's so much cheaper. Yeah, recommend if you move down here, look into Kroger. So good, but yeah. Publix is right next to our house. So here we are, gotta get rice and dog food, yay. Well, I survived the grocery store and we are back home. It was a good day. Saw some beautiful flowers, had an amazing meal at Muse. But yeah, my belly is full and I am tired. I think it might be nap time, especially with this beautiful sun coming down on me. Oh, yawn, yawn. Anyway, well, thanks for walking with us. We didn't do too much walking. We did a lot of, a lot of driving, but that's okay. Some days are like that. But anyway, just want to remind you to drink the drinks and do all the things. Strike that, reverse it. Do all the things, drink the drinks. You know what I mean. Join us next time. Bye.